BBC IDs. Yes, that's what you BBC I. Let me tell you about Ahmed. He's very deep in thinking. One key thing that I have in common with him is patience and the ability to relax, think carefully about issues before we act. If you are not careful, you'd think that we are laid back people, but we process things in a very calm manner before we make decisions. Uh, Ahmed has always been part of the team and he's played very strategic roles and he's also the imam of the team and so you find us in a village and if we have to pray he leads the prayer and um, quite jovial too sometimes uh, he, he understands the need to, this, to do this work and he's very passionate I will call him a soldier of righteousness Sometimes, even when I am calming down an issue, he would call me and say, well, yes, it's true to be calm about it, but it's still an issue that we have to look at. And um, he's just that person who stands for the rights of people, that person who uses very last energy, last money to film undercover to expose the bad guys. It saddens my heart that today we are here and Ahmed is no more with us and he's with Allah. Um, I wish this had not happened, but it has. Naturally, we know that people don't like what we do. Uh, we also know that our job is not to make people smile. Our job is to expose the wicked and the corrupt. So uh, I'm not a happy man that he's no more. He will leave a big hole in the team. But one thing I do know about Ahmed is that wherever he is, he's looking at us here. He's with us in spirit as a team member. And he will hate to see that we are sitting idle without pushing the frontiers. He will hate to watch us say that we are going to cow down because of this event. Deep within him, he will want us to keep fighting. He will want us to expose more bad people. Since the thing happened, uh, um, colleagues, who are in the team have sent memories. Some of the funny memories, some of the intense moments during the heat, some of the things he said, and that is what has really kept us going. And that is what gives us the confidence that whatever it is, Ahmed is with us in spirit. Well, we are Tiger Eye will remain resolute. We know what this thing means. We know that some people too are sitting somewhere who want to take advantage of this death of Ahmed to inflame passion, especially of the Muslim community, to attack. That is not what Ahmed believes in. Ahmed is a non-violent person and let not anybody think that revenge or reprisals is the way out. What Ahmed would rather love to see us do is to keep fighting corruption, is to keep standing to be counted, is to keep doing the right thing and to be like him, a soldier of righteousness.